And this is a crucial third down play coming up. Prevent defense here, trying to avoid the deep pass. It's Rivers down the field. And he reaches out and makes the catch. One-handed, no less. First down, pressure on every snap now. Jim, good job by the offense here. You don't have any timeouts left, so you must get that football snap. See how many plays you can get in before the game is over. The Chargers line up for the field goal try. If the kick goes through, this one will, in all likelihood, be headed to overtime. And it's good. Clutch kick at the right moment. Very clutch. The long field goal to tie the game in the last two minutes. They could have taken the lead with that drive, but they get the field goal in the clutch by the kicker. Yeah, nice job. You're right, doing it in the clutch, and it doesn't matter how far it is. Your teammates, they expect you to make it, and the kicker got it done. The Eagles come onto the field. The game now is in the hands of this offensive unit with the game tied, Phil. Jim, this is a situation now where you just don't come out here and just try to make it happen. The game is tied. If it doesn't work, you figure, well, let's try to get into overtime. So be careful on these first couple plays and make sure you don't make a big mistake. The Chargers ready to return the kick. Davis going to run this one out. And the tackle's made right around the 26-yard line. The Chargers bring their offense onto the field. The last time they had control of the football, they did not come away empty-handed, but did not get a touchdown either. Well, they got that field goal, and I think that's important. That field goal gave them a little confidence. They got some points up there that always makes you feel good on the offensive side. Now take advantage of that good feeling. Go out there and score a touchdown this time. Let's see if they can finish off a drive. They're able to move the chains after that last run. Stands in the pocket. Melvin Gordon makes the reception. Gordon's tackled down after a gain of 15. What's the old expression? Just move the chains. That's what they did with that throw and catch that time, Jim. It also gives them a chance for three more downs. First and ten. Handoff made. Tackle made by Barwin that time. Always good to have these types of runs. Hey, it's not a first down, but it sends a message. It shows everybody that you can run it when you want to. And also, it opens up so many other things for your offense. Second down, four to go. Gets it again. Fights through that hit. Gordon is a great running back to have on your football team, isn't he? He goes up in there and gets the first down. Now your offense has three more chances. First down here. Phillip Rivers has it under center. Rivers, that throw intended for Malcolm Floyd. Floyd's going to be so mad at himself for dropping that football because receivers, you never know when your chance is going to come. And then finally, you get open. They call a play where you're the, the primary guy. It's right there, and you drop it. Well, don't get down on yourself. Stay up. The football will come your way again. Oliver has the catch. It's a walk-off touchdown beyond belief. Even on short passes, accuracy is a big, big deal. When you put it on them, right in stride, look what happens 